This episode of Inside High School Sports is brought to you by Bubba's Landscape. Do you need landscaping services for your home or business? Count on Bubba's Landscape in Leroy. Working on residential and commercial landscapes throughout western New York, whether you need your driveway shoveled or new flower beds for your front lawn, you can count on Bubba's superior attention to detail, timely completion, and competitive rates for any type of landscaping work you may need. Get an estimate today. Call 585-768-6578 to schedule landscaping and lawn maintenance for your home or business. Coach, what can you take away from the first matchup that will better prepare you for this upcoming matchup against Leroy on Saturday? Well, we just need to take care of the ball. I mean, there, uh, last time we played, we turned the ball over five times, um, gave him some great field position. So I think if we can not turn the ball over and, and, and control the field position, um, we're, we're hoping it'll be a better ball game. Coach, you defeated Attica Alexander the first time around during the regular season. It was kind of a back and forth game. Your team came out on top. What can you take away from that game that will serve you well in this matchup and, and hopefully for you guys put you, put you on the right uh, step toward success? Uh, I think the biggest thing about the uh, the first game is that we know we have a really tough opponent ahead of us. Um, we're definitely going to have to play our best. We know that. Um, and I think we knew that going into the first game, but it's definitely been highlighted since then that they are uh, they're not someone you can go in and turn the ball over, have penalties, take plays off. Um, so I think... I mean, obviously, there's the film. There's some things we think we can uh, take advantage of, some things we think we could clean up. But I think the biggest thing is just understanding that that's a good team over there, and we're going to have to play our best. Landon, you guys have experience at the championship level, having won it all last year. This Leroy team, a little bit new to this level of play. Do you think your experience at the championship level will serve you well in this upcoming matchup? Uh, yeah, I think it will help. I think all the boys know under pressure, what we can do. Last year, at East Rochester's game, we have a minute left. Boys are working, we got it done. I think uh, atmosphere, we're used to it, so I think we'll be good. Trent, same question to you. You guys in the Alexander program had plenty of experience at the championship level over the years. You come in, you join this Attica team. How has that experience level served you throughout the season, and do you anticipate some of those jitters to already have been worked away having experienced a championship level environment as you guys have? No, yeah, I think it helps a lot. Being uh, almost a senior team with a bunch of seniors on the team, a lot of experience. Not many people crack under pressure on our team, so it's we know what it takes to win at a high level against the good team. So. What have you guys been doing? What have you been saying to each other this week and even in past weeks to keep that intensity level up the fall football season can be a grind all the way into the sectional final week so what have you guys been saying to each other tommy to to keep that that energy level up and and make sure it's where it needs to be entering this game oh well for a lot of us this could be our last time playing football so i think that's really really helped the seniors get in the right mindset and i know for me this could be one of my last games so I'm really excited to play and don't really want to lose. Tony, kind of on that same wavelength, Leroy football, the tradition built there, it's it's very well known throughout Section 5, but you guys haven't claimed sectional glory in just under a decade. So to return that championship block to Leroy and to do it with the guys, as Tommy alluded to, that you've been playing with for so long and, and it being your last season as a senior, how much would that mean to you to, to restore championship glory to Leroy as you make your way through those uh, doors for the final time this fall? Um, it would mean a lot. Uh, we really we want to win. We've been working hard with each other since March, but we've been, we've been playing with each other most of us for 10, 12 years. And, you know, we, we didn't get it done last year. We really want to win a sectional title this year. So... Coach, you're a Leroy alum. You know how much it means to this community and these athletes and coaches and, and, and everybody involved with Leroy football. Can, can you touch on that and, and just the, the the gravity of the moment that your kids are going to face going into this championship game on Saturday, knowing how much it means to to everybody there at Leroy? Um, yeah, there's no doubt it is it is a big deal, okay? And we wouldn't want it any other way. Um, the... Uh, the attention you get and maybe the pressure you get here in this community is is a good thing. 
Okay, we got a lot of supporters. We got a lot of people that are on our side, a lot of people that are really excited for Saturday night. Uh, but at the end of the day, it is just another, you know, it's, it's just like week one. We approach it the same way. You get your work in during the week and the score will take care of itself, right? So you try not to make too much out of it, but at the same time, try to get the kids to understand the, the gravity of it without making it, uh, you know, overwhelming, right? Um, and I think, I think we've done that. Um, I think we put in the work this week. We got another practice today. Um, and then with this team, you, they don't need to be convinced that Leroy football, um, I didn't need to make them care about Leroy football, right? This is a team that not only loves football, but they understand what this community is all about um, and what this program is all about. Um, and I think, uh, you know, just approaching it day by day, one practice, one rep, one play at a time, is the way to go in these certain, you know, in these situations. You don't want to make it too big. Landon, how much are you looking forward to this game, an opportunity to defend your championship and an opportunity to avenge that regular season loss at the hands of Leroy? I'm excited. You know, I think our team's been waiting for this the whole season ever since that loss. I think they earned their strike there, but I think we got to earn ours back. And I think we're going to have to get the job done. Get back to back. Same question to you, Trent. How much are you guys looking forward to this opportunity to avenge that loss and go back to back potentially? So yeah, it was it was a tough loss early in the season. You know, we we're still working a couple things out, but I'm confident all the guys on our team they got a chip on their shoulder now, and uh, they got something to play for, and they want they want to defend the block. Coach, you think these guys are ready? Where are their minds at? Where are these? Where's the energy level? The intensity? You think it's where it needs to be heading into the championship? Yeah, each day we you know we build that intensity, and I, I think we're you know we're starting to get to the top of the the, the ladder there, and and I'm mean, I'm excited. You know, I mean, I, it's a good group of kids, and they've worked hard. They understand that you know the last time we played them, it, it didn't come out in our favor, and we're um, we're, we're looking forward to a, an excellent matchup, and, and and we're excited, and I think we're right where we need to be at this point. Uh, we're we're just, we're ready to play. We uh we're ready for a fight, and we are we're hoping to come out on top. So uh, you go from first round of sectionals to the second round it just gets more and more exciting in the finals i've never been in the finals so i'm very excited and so is the team yep. This episode of Inside High School Sports is brought to you by Bubba's Landscape. Do you need landscaping services for your home or business? Count on Bubba's Landscape in Leroy. Working on residential and commercial landscapes throughout western New York, whether you need your driveway shoveled or new flower beds for your front lawn, you can count on Bubba's superior attention to detail, timely completion, and competitive rates for any type of landscaping work you may need. Get an estimate today. Call 585-768-6578 to schedule landscaping and lawn maintenance for your home or business.